No Jumper, coolest podcast in the world. I'm in here with my man, Almighty Sus Gerb, and we are with what I've been told or what I've been hearing in the streets is one of the hottest groups coming out of Manhattan in many years in the drill scene. We got the sweepers in the building. How y'all doing? Chillin' you are. Yeah, yeah. Let, let's make it super Fons. easy on the editors and, and everybody just introduce themselves one by one. That is Nas, you are. That's that go. J Ham. J Five, you are. For sure. And uh, all right, let's start talking about uh, where you guys are coming from exactly. Because I just found out that I actually have been to you guys' projects like over the summer, which yeah, is kind of kind of crazy. We got a picture together. So we all all right. So we all met, and I just didn't even realize that you guys were lit like that. Or were you, were you lit at the nah, time? I don't think it this was full all of circle. Us. That's wild. Yeah, I, ain't gonna lie. I sent them y'all. Sh- I'm got like, the picture bro, right this is all I'm listening to right now. These niggas going crazy. <laughs> Yo, yeah, he didn't even know he already met y'all. That's I wasn't crazy. even. We wasn't wow. even. For me. When you uh, he wasn't over. rapping yet. We was, but we wasn't like how we are it now. Wasn't when lit, he was yeah. Over yeah, there. yeah, it wasn't. When he was over there, we wasn't. Feel me? Time flies, man. That's crazy. That's yeah, later. Yeah, full circle I, moment. I got some fashion over pants he on in that delay. picture. Um, but yeah, that that was a wild day because I remember we pedaled all the way from uh, some some spot in Astoria to in we, Queens. Yeah. Oh, hell over man. the bridge. We took over the whole bridge. The whole bridge stopped. We can insert some footage right now here, maybe. But uh, and then we get there, and there's this one rail, and like only a few things had been done on this rail, and it's just you have like 400 people there, and they just went nuts and did like everything you could ever think of on that rail. So and then the cops came and kicked us out. So so you That's rolled crazy. to their projects on the bike, probably like six miles or some. Shit. From Astoria? How far is that far? Astoria is like on a 30, bike, 40 minutes deep. in a car. Yeah. That's wild. So that means on a bike, that's like, what? Yeah, we took over the whole right. bridge. I've never hey. seen anything like it before. Why? Why? It's like a, I would have been up It probably took a good hour, 45 minutes at least. For real. Like, y'all done lost y'all mind, bro. I'm not going to lie. We got it to me. There's a lot of non-white people there for the right. Meet me there. Even the majority. I don't know. I had to put the bike on the on the top of the truck. Meet me there. You mean six miles? So, all right. But that that right there is where you guys are all from. Yeah. yeah that's a fact. That's yeah. our block. And Douglas? How long have yeah. you known each other? Like, uh, since you were super young? Or? Basically all our life yeah. type yeah. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. Hey. Y'all that's all grew up in the same projects together? Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's right. Mm. So what it's like living in Douglas projects? For me? It's regular. Mm. Boy, you just chill out, man. <laughs> regular. Rap, rap, get rap, money. and Play basketball, get money. Or, so uh, like that. Y'all know ball players? Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, I one, once upon a time, a little bit. Who was nice though? To me, of course. Yeah. <laughs> Jay. I said, me. Yo, Jay, we don't even got to talk about. What we I made talking, articles. Right? I don't even got to talk about, about my, 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 my resume. So y'all was balling hard before y'all was <laughs> from before y'all start getting lit or, or not like me, growing up. Not type. I was playing ball, but I don't know. Bro. Nah, yeah, like, like it was different I levels. Yeah, was I was playing ball. I was playing ball for like we was playing ball for real. I was playing ball AU. Me and Jay was on teams. School teams are like you feel me nah, in the like neighborhood teams. type. Nah, like like AU, school like, teams, like middle school, yeah, mm, high school, a little AU, bit, some, skipping mm, states, first playing ball, yeah, tournaments. Yeah. Yeah. You feel me? Travel yeah, team. Yeah, they, yeah. I was only on like two teams in my life. Yeah, I just stopped playing ball. Why you stop? Not stop playing ball. I just stopped being on teams. Right. Well, why'd you stop? At a certain point, you were like, I want to rap and smoke weed. I can't nah, play basketball. I not. <laughs> I, like my grades wasn't me enough. So I was just not playing ball. No more. Kicking nigga right off. I was still playing ball. I wasn't yeah, on the team. Ball land with that. Oh yeah, I'm wild. I'm wild. Mm. Oh, shit. Around, oh, you got another one at third too, my bro. Right. Nah, but yeah, I stopped. I stopped. I stopped. I mean, I wasn't on the team no more. Uh, so, so is it wild in Douglas on a daily basis? Is a crazy ass place to be from? No, nah, it's mean? regular. I mean, you could interpret however you want. You seen crazy shit since you were young going on out there? Nah. Regular hush. You seen crazy shit everywhere. To be honest, it's a fact. Regular growing up. Regular. Like growing up anywhere. For me, it's just gonna be. It could be Any tough projects. anywhere. Regular street. It's not. Yeah. It's not something. I mean, it's not crazy. But so people try to belittle y'all and act like you're from the Upper West Side and like even though you're right on the edge of Harlem or whatever, is this like a narrative that your ops try to put on you that you guys are from some nice part of Manhattan? <laughs> nah, it could be, be like fans, like fans yeah. that get us mixed up with like Harlem. Yeah, because the outside like, world, I didn't know. Yeah, you feel yeah. me? I I just knew like all right, Harlem is inside Manhattan. I didn't know it was Upper it's Manhattan fine. downtown. Like yeah, I didn't yeah, know it was different. Yeah. Different, oh, no, different yeah. too. Yeah, it's different. We from Upper West Side. Yeah, mm, like LES. Part. Upper West Side. We got Chinatown behind. Chinatown so behind. Whole. It's massive. <clears throat> right, so for the outside world, because I be reading comments and be arguing, no, they from Harlem. No. No, these is yeah. from Upper Wood. Fans yeah. be arguing back and forth. For, for, let everybody know you for me specifically. Yeah, they from, we, we from where? We from, we from the Upper West, West Side. We from Douglas, Douglas Projects. Project, Upper West Side. We are not from Harlem. We from they set the record straight, so 
to stop arguing in the comments. But, and but shit isn't it kind of bullshit? Because the people act like everywhere in Harlem is some gangster ass shit. And reality is, is that Harlem is one of the most gentrified areas in Manhattan with like crazy nice developments and hella white people living there nah, and yeah, shit, right? It's one of the most That's softest fact. places on the yeah. <laughs> Basically. I mean, de- definitely. When you're up, up like a lot of Manhattan, upper West it's nice as too, fuck though. in general. Yeah, there's yeah. a lot of areas that are fucking super, like, it's one of the most expensive Yo, fucking old areas old. in it's the world. It's getting like that out here, too. Yep. Some of the trenches, they tearing it all down. White mm-hmm. people walking everywhere, walking their dogs. You wouldn't believe it, nigga. But when did y'all decide to actually start rapping? How did this uh, transformation take place? I fake started rapping like... I got a song in like 2020. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So you was first? But I wasn't. But that wasn't for real, though. I just did it. Because I heard my other mans made a song. So yeah, I, I did, did it. I, I wasn't situation. rapping, though. Your yeah, mans? Like your friend song. or your op? Yeah, my friends. Okay. I heard I them make a song, so I just made one. I started playing around 2019 type shit. Mm-hmm. SoundCloud, YouTube, SoundCloud. Yeah, no was, videos yet, just SoundCloud, SoundCloud yeah, shit. Niggas from Douglas, we was dropping on SoundCloud in like yeah, 2019, it was 2020. Straight SoundCloud. Mm. Straight y'all SoundCloud. all ha- had these names already, or y'all was coming up with us? My shit was, yeah, like, uh, my shit was always son, like, S. Dot. 2019, my shit was like, S. Dot. I think, what was my I started rapping late. I made a song in 2018. That shit was wack, though. <laughs> so y'all wasn't so y'all was doing it differently, yeah. not as no group. Nah, matter of fact, niggas was rapping by themselves. Was making songs with each other. So, so y'all was already doing it collectively on SoundCloud. Yeah, we yeah, didn't we have a group certain name. people. Mm, so it wasn't. I wasn't. On that. I yeah. wasn't dropping on SoundCloud. Like that wasn't. I wasn't yeah. a part. They of was dropping on SoundCloud. Yeah. All right, all right. So I had seen at first it was just like. Nas and then you on songs and then you popped up. I was locked up. You was locked yeah, up. Yeah. For what? Came home. Started going crazy. It's <laughs> <laughs> that some little shit. You Mr. Beat and shit. A little situation. Shit. Yeah, mm. Situation. Little situation. Okay. So how how long you was locked? <sighs> I got locked up. Then I bailed out and then I got locked up again and mm. then I got remanded for like I was locked up for like nine months. Ten months, like a year, yeah, almost like a year. Was you hearing about them going crazy when you was locked? Yeah, they was rapping and shit. I was hyped. I ain't gonna lie, like uh. they used to play that shit. Like I used to be on the phone while they was at their music videos. Shit used to be lit. I ain't gonna lie. And I was in jail. That shit was lit. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm about to be in the video, seeing uh. my talking my shit on the phone. Feel me? And then I just came home. Came I was home locked up from. I was. I, they was doing that shit for like four months while I was locked up. Well, they was like. Nah, videos. Before y'all were rapping, though, who you listening to that was like influencing you to actually want to do it? Chicago, Chicago drill rappers. Mm. Yeah. Chicago love. Niggas love. Who? Who y'all favorite Chicago drill rappers? Dirk. Like Chief Dirk, Keith. Dirk. Chief Keith. Chief the GOAT. Chief, yeah, Dirk, Chief, Chief, Chief is tough. And, and, Dirk. And, um, Herb. For sure, Herb. Nah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, That's I ain't gonna lie. From Chicago, it was Dirk and Chief Keith. I was like, nah, I'm about to just rap. Chief. You guys Vaughn fans? Huh? You fans of Vaughn? I'm not gonna Vaughn? say I'm a Vaughn fan. I'm like not. I'm not a Vaughn fan on the music tip. That's all I'm gonna say. You don't like his music? I think his nah, music nah, is amazing. I like how Vaughn get out yeah. in the street. Nah, I'm, like, I'm not a fan. I like on the his music body. Tip. I ain't gonna lie. I like yeah, I'm not. I fuck with Vaughn. Like who he I'll was as a person. Yeah, 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 I'm not yeah. a stand up fan. I'm not a. He was a real nigga. He got that shit hundred. I'm not a Vaughn fan, but hearing his background and shit, and then like him rapping. It, it make, make you want to go and change in the coming home, do his thing, like that. Nah, I'm to, not gonna lie, I fuck with Vaughn music. To me, Vaughn is like the ultimate combination because he's like so real and he fucking the music was really good. That's but it's interesting to hear yeah, you guys mostly I'm motivated by just the the stories. <laughs> nah, that's yeah. a fact. I wasn't too hip to his music either. You feel me? But once I heard his background, I'm like, oh, that yeah, nigga really like, tripping. Yeah, that's a fact. I'm gonna go listen. Nah, you know, listen, no listen, cap. Once you know a nigga really right, doing it, because I interviewed a lot of yeah, yeah, yeah. I interviewed him when I only knew about the music, like mostly. Like yeah. I didn't really know about like the vast majority of all the shit that we know now when I actually talked to him. But it would have been weird to talk to him at that time about that shit because it's like, uh, what the fuck early, are you gonna say? Yeah, too early to ask about all that shit. Damn, but Thinking so rich enough, yeah. y'all weren't motivated by any of the New York drill? Nah, like we was listening to New York drill. Like, what, what, what year are you talking about? Like, y'all when we first started rapping, Jill, like twenty eighteen, twenty nineteen. Um, the era of pop. Brooklyn, music. probably Brooklyn mm. drill rappers. It, they ain't inspire me, but that's the like the the music I was listening to and. In 2019, Man, I was who listening, listening to. Who you listening to in 2019? Like Brooklyn like niggas, Chef and G and yeah, shit, right? Chef G, shit like that, like yeah. mm. Brooklyn shit. I, like I ain't gonna lie, I was listening to low key rappers in Brooklyn. I was listening Wolves. to Lil Mouse. 
folks. For real? Little I Mom used to go crazy, yeah, nigga. Yeah, yeah. Was I was good good. I don't think I ever nigga, the money did. Well, but in 2019, I, I can't sing a full nigga. song with Lil Mouse. You talking about listening to Lil Mouse in 2019? Nigga said Lil Mouse. Not 2019. I was listening to Lil Mouse in like 2013, bro. 2012. That's what I'm saying. Back in the day, nigga. Dipping in the I got to hear a song. I'll probably know it, but I don't. I never heard it. You don't know Lil Mouse? I know who Lil Mouse is. I never heard it. And this I'm nigga smack. funny as fuck. I can't smack. sing. I can't sing a I'm full a, a full song of Lil Mouse. That's I don't think even a full song I is a lot. I, I like L.A. Capone and shit. Yeah. This nigga Jay said I'm for yeah, the Capone niggas. too. How about you say L.A. Capone? He said 2019. <laughs> I'm My talking team. about for the Chicago tip though. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I like that. That was that was that was like 2015, 2016. That but if you talk about 2019, I was really listening to Brooklyn. Wasn't no Bronx rap. You think Brooklyn's still hot music wise? No. Certain rappers is nice, but I mean, I feel like the attention is not really on Brooklyn how it was before. Mm. It was mad attention on Brooklyn. Brooklyn. I feel like a lot of the nice drill rappers is locked up. I was just finna say, what y'all think made that change to where it went from Brooklyn to more Bronx, Harlem type shit? Because different flows start coming out. Yeah, different flows start coming out. I I just feel like people started hearing different shit. Different beats, different flows. I ain't gonna lie. I, I wasn't a fan. Of the Brooklyn wave, like when everybody was on, I was just like, I don't know what y'all. But hearing. that shit was like twenty six. As soon as I heard the Bronx shit, I'm like, hey, yeah. Now this that shit I hear hard. the Brooklyn shit, me? now that I hear some of the Brooklyn shit I used to listen to, it'd be like, nah, this shit fake. Like, <laughs> shit why? Not it. It's too slow for me. It's slow, yeah. Like it's I used, I'd be like, nah, this shit was dead. Why we dad used to like this shit? Niggas used to bump that shit. All right. all That's all one thing I realized is that all the drill songs, all the Bronx drill and everything, has like slowed down versions on YouTube with the lyrics on the screen, so you can really know what they're talking about. Yeah, they do that shit. That's they very do that useful too. to me. Yeah, they do that they shit. Do that too. Too. I don't know sure. what the fuck people are talking about half the time when they're rapping full speed. That's a fact. Never mind yeah, the sped up TikTok. To that that shit a lot. That. I ain't gonna lie. Nah, but there's certain people in Brooklyn that that face still got it. Mm. Who y'all fuck with? That's still over there. Nah, I, I don't really listen to Brooklyn, me personally. But like, but like Chef G, <coughs> Sleepy, like people. Still I jack two six like a all shit. Oh yeah, here I jack two six. People still listen to certain people in Brooklyn. Certain people in Brooklyn still get listened to. Yeah, that's a fact. Only Brooklyn drill rap I probably listen to right now. I don't even listen to um like I ain't gonna lie to be honest, bro. I really only play. I was shit. I'm I would, yeah, that's what I, all y'all listening to your, I'm yourself right like now. That. Yeah, that's a fact. So I don't really even go on YouTube and really listen to other people. But before I was listening like AR and shit, I fuck with Rich Nunu shit. Mm, couple niggas y'all still fuck with. So let me throw this out here on my messy tip. Uh, one thing about you guys is that you guys beef with like the OYS, Sev Side, Sugar Hill, etc. And to th- those are like people who beef with each other. You guys kind of got problems with everybody. Was that a thing before you started <laughs> popping with the music, or did you kind of get issues with people afterwards? Nah, I mean, this rap shit didn't cause no no. It yeah, ain't cause no problem. Yeah, like rap shit was just rap. Whatever it was, it had been. But nah, certain shit. Yeah, but on the tip that you saying, nah, shit, yeah, it's nah, just some neighborhood like, shit, and then y'all yeah, end up rapping later. Yeah, that's a fact. But were you guys rapping about that from the beginning? Yeah, sure, sure. I mean, that's out. Yeah, yeah. Did you hear yeah, other niggas? Like, did y'all hear niggas dissing like, y'all and then y'all like, nah, I'm finna, we finna respond type shit. Was that what it was, or niggas just nah, woke up we like we on that? We was just like, nah. Niggas just doing their thing and it just yeah, end up yeah, coming yeah, like that. Like, we was on some shit. Fuck these niggas. I feel that. These niggas. I mean, you guys got Dougie B to write a whole song about you. That's gonna feel pretty good. You know, he's one of the bigger Ooh. drill artists out there. Ooh. Dougie. You said he did what? He made a whole song about you guys, right? I don't even know. I ain't really, like, I don't What's let the, the whole song, song play, so I don't know. You don't listen to your own, I this is skits, about you? Nah, I be hearing skits on Instagram and shit, like. Like, little shit will pop up. Yeah. And like, we'll see it, but we're not going to listen to yeah, that. You're not going to go play that shit. Nah, I'll fuck around and play some of the ops, but I'm not going to lie. Yeah, but um, nah, some his, songs. Like, yeah, some him songs, specifically. But. That song that 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 you probably was talking about, I didn't I didn't listen to. That shit. I only heard skits, uh-huh. like little shit popping up on Instagram. Yeah. Why, I think you, it's crazy you, to diss a nigga and take a nigga whole little ooh wop little beat little. Fall. I think that's crazy. crazy. Yo, that shit is crazy. That's, crazy. that's a little you, you crazy. Can't, that's you can't crazy. curse on it, right? And then throw the frank while you doing it. If I'm a diss a nigga, <laughs> I'm gonna do it on my own shit. But take a nigga beat. <laughs> flow, What's that's throwing the frank? That means he's sucking dick. Suck my dick, like. Taking oh, a nigga whole flow. I feel like that's 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 not using 
That's not using your own clout. You feel me? That's mm. not gaining your own fan That's like you eat a dick. My shit fire, man. <laughs> but when I realized that y'all were really wild <laughs> is when I realized that y'all have beef with Murder B, the queen of New York. No, I know we don't. I fuck with Murder B. Y'all fuck with you? Yeah. Oh, I thought you guys had to have beef with her because she in all your ops videos There's and no everything. Beef with nothing. Uh, you mm. just can't beef with women or what? Uh, nah, it's not I'll, Murder B. Uh, me. That's my son. Why would I beef with? Like, we don't beef with her. Unnecessary. I don't beef with oh, females. Okay. Uh-huh. I feel that's that. good. You feel me? Yeah, Just be yeah. a, associates and shit. Yeah. We gotta but respect I don't beef women. With you, though. Yeah, you gotta. You feel me? Uplift Selling the features. women. You know what I'm saying? No, that's right. Okay. You guys fuck with Ice Spice? <laughs> biggest, the biggest question in every interview. I ain't gonna say I fuck with, but I ain't gonna lie. She's she bugging. Got her songs. Oh, yeah, yeah, she got his songs. Yeah, she doing her thing. She doing her thing. She doing her thing. You think she's smart, staying out all the crazy she's shit that y'all smart. are all involved she's in? Moving, dumb smart. <laughs> that's a fact, bro. She, moving, she could smart. get bigger like that. You mm-hmm. can get bigger. Staying out the politics. The majority of New York. Do y'all feel like the politics like hold shit back as far as the music scene out there? What you mean? Like you know what I'm saying like. Cause some areas like say for Atlanta, how people look at it, like a lot of motherfuckers fuck with each other. Like, do you feel like the gang shit make it hard for niggas to do music with motherfuckers? Or do you feel like if it wasn't no street politics, y'all would do songs with people? Yeah, it, it, it do be like that. Yeah. The streets do talk and a lot of people yeah, it, it do be like that. But, but like just, us specifically, we dead stand on business though. Nah, yeah. yeah. Just cause you do a song with somebody that don't fuck with somebody else don't mean you I mean, you're going to have beef with that other person. Shit yeah. got nothing to do with us. But certain people dead business. think like that. That's so certain fact, people dead would not. Everybody else thinks like that. Yeah. We don't think like that. Yeah, me. That's certain not, people, they would dead not do like music that. with other people just I mean, because that block got beef with this block. And it has nothing to do with them. As long as they people don't. Niggas back. picking sides and it don't got nothing to do with them. <laughs> yeah. 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 As me long as people don't diss my dad's in the songs, I don't care. Do you think that in a couple of years, when you think about yourself rapping, do you imagine yourself still dissing your ops and talking about all that kind of shit, or you think you're going to grow out of it at a certain point? What? What'd you say? Dissing the ops and doing all the beef shit and songs. Like, nah, you think you're going to grow out of it, or is that yeah. permanent? Nah, I'm going to grow out of it. Nah, I ain't going to lie. I'm going to grow out of it, but I'm going to still do it. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Nah, yeah, that's what I'm gonna Dirk grow doing it. But Dirk still do it. That's what I'm saying. Dirk and I don't call it this in the ops. Like, I just like what? what is look look at the influence right there. Dirk still do it. That's like, oh fuck man, like fuck it. He's successful and he at fuck. the top. Yeah, and it's kind of hard when it's your life. Millions like, of dollars. Yeah, how can man. you stop rapping about your life? Basically, that's what I'm saying. You feel me? Like, it's still going on in his life. It's still happening. I don't really refer to it as this. And I'm talking about reminding them type shit. When we diss out, I feel like we remind people. Definitely. Um, how'd you guys get involved in this whole naughty thing? Like, uh, talking about him and sons and shit like that. This is because, I mean, that, that's, you guys are traveling all over New York to have different ops in all different areas. Like, how did that work out? What you mean, like, what you mean about that? Like, how do we, like, what you oh, mean? Oh, this image? I mean, yeah, we've heard a lot of, like, the, you know, people in Brooklyn doing the naughty bop and all fucking right, so all over the place. Like, I feel like for me, I've been all before it was a nah, trend. That's what I'm saying. I, I'm before keep it was a book. trend. It was just like that. Like before, we was even before. going crazy dissing them. They was just dissing all dead run, for me dead ones and shit, dead friends and shit. And then it's like, right after that shit, we just seen a video of this little kid getting picked up the steps, and that's really what it was. <laughs> <laughs> Not much. So they were already dissing you, and then when you yeah, see the really video of him getting poked, just it, like, you just had this clown. Famous, <laughs> yeah, before like, clown. they was famous. Damn. Been for me. It been lit. It been so up. it's been like up. you feel me. Basically. Why would you not? Cause it's already been going on type shit. Everybody like, new to this, to be honest. Yeah, a, a lot of us are like, oh my god, how could you? It's so cruel. But then when you think about it, it's like, I don't know. It's, it's not a system that's gonna reward somebody being more compassionate, right? Look how hard he's laughing. Look at this guy. Yeah, Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> look, we gonna go to a lighter subject. Ooh, how y'all baby, feel about look? Cause. I know at first y'all was doing more type beats that that everybody do, and then y'all decided to go more towards the you feel me kind of Jersey, but like dark type shit. You mm, feel me? Like what made y'all want to start picking in beats? At? We had to find our sound. Right. Word. All those other beats we was bodying and shit, but we was trying to find our sound. Nah, yeah. We could we body those dark Jersey beats. Nobody body those more than us. Yeah, that's a fact. I ain't gonna lie. To it ain't gonna get sound. better than us on those beats. How y'all feel about everybody starting to hop on the wave, nigga? Because I'm watching. It's cool. Everybody doing it's cool. that shit. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool, it's cool for you the people doing it. Yeah. 
That's a fact. But we know we did. Trendsetters. Imitation is the greatest form of flattery. That's flattery, nigga. How you know? did you? How did you guys even like really start getting as many views as you're getting now at this point? Like, like, how did it scale up so fast that in like six months you guys just all of a sudden are doing like half a million at least on like every video and shit? Consistent. I don't even know. Yeah, just consistency. Y'all consistent. I'm not gonna lie. When I started yeah, to talk me, at the time. Drop weird niggas out. Ooh, that shit fake shot. Yeah, like Mike performance. That shit just paved the whole way. Yeah, and we just realized. People right just after that, we just realized people just like those shine every other day. Like every yeah. other day, we was dropping. People That's just want to hear more. That's why we just keep like, dropping consistently because we don't want to let nobody else come up on it. us. Mm. Yeah, I mean, all this uh, Bronx Manhattan hip hop shit. And now it's all the drill shit. It's like I don't know. The shit seems like sometimes it's like, like do you, do you feel like the fans are quick to turn on you? Cause, or not on you guys necessarily, but sometimes you see rappers who have a wave, they get millions of views, and then it seems like that shit just kind of fizzles out after like six months. The fans just lose interest. Do you feel like the best way to combat that is just drop relentlessly, just no, drop yeah, over just and over? Stay yeah. We gotta just keep giving them what they want, and we do. And it's four of us. Plus, we got more sweeper rappers that be rapping, so it's like it's gonna be a lot of drops. How y'all come up with the name sweepers? Was that already some shit in the hood, <laughs> or, or was that some rap shit? Me, my, one of my means, one of my means that's locked up right now started so mm. cap now. That's a fact. That's fire. So basically, like that was some shit that was already going on, but y'all just yeah, was the ones who started to rap with it. So it's like yeah. y'all got it on y'all back. Yeah, now, it was already shit. like a plan. It was already, it was already planned out. It was already, already friend group. Start family. Something. You think the sample drill is played out? Nah, and nah, it's gone it to this be, Jersey dark club drill I shit. Mean, it's it's not played out. It's just be hard to clear, bro. It's not played. That would just be hard to clear, bro. Yeah, so it's like, right. that shit getting niggas mad sometimes. That bro. came across y'all table already? You feel me? Where y'all tried to drop some hard shit and had a sample and y'all couldn't? Nah, we just we just understand uh, how it would get with samples. Like, it yeah. be problems. You know I mean? Like, we, fam we familiar. Like, we know what's up. That's why we try to stay away from the samples. But I'll do a sample, bro. I ain't gonna lie. And then fuck rapping, my rapping, lies, but. my lies. Not everybody be on some shit like yo. I need bread from that, but certain people do. That's be true. Like, I some motherfuckers will let it go. Like ah, I fuck with y'all. That was that was yeah, fire. I'm but fine. some motherfuckers yeah, gonna be like, yeah, I need, yeah, that I need check. some bread. That's yeah. a fact. So it's like you never know. Do you guys sign? No, nah. nah. you didn't sign yet. We not uh, signed. Yet. You been hearing offers and shit? Yeah, yeah. Gotta be. This nigga's going viral, bro. Yeah. Gotta be. Yeah, but we not yeah. signed no all this organic. Really? How y'all feel about taking a deal? Y'all want to stay independent, build y'all leverage, or y'all feel like y'all want to take a deal? <coughs> we just we chilling right now. We just trying to find the right. We trying to see it. We doing Whatever everything the best good situation on our own. Is. Yeah, we just waiting for the right amount. We doing good on our best own right now. That's a fact. You know we chilling. Hey, we ain't rushing. Definitely. What? Uh, yeah. Are there artists that you guys would be excited to work with? Anybody in particular that you'd like to tap in with? Maybe even Ice outside Spice. the drill world. Ice Spice. Yeah. <laughs> See? I knew it. I knew it. I'm not gonna lie. I, 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 Dirk. I, I don't know rappers. I then don't know. I want to make a song with a, like an industry artist. I want to. So, yeah, some shit with Dirk. Yeah, I want some like shit with one of them. Mm. I want with, with main Dirk street rappers. Baby. Baby go crazy. Everything baby <laughs> get on. She go viral, bro. Yeah, yeah. But that nigga like the feature king. Everything he so hop on. I get baby on the song. Feature so king, saying. nigga. Hey, baby, you see this. All right, I'll see what's it. going on. I get on a song with Lil Uzi. And Uzi. Mm. Yo, Uzi. What's up, Uzi? Right. Uzi on a dark, Uzi. on a he dark jersey drill type, yeah, type. He gonna, he gonna jack come on. my mother. He, he gonna, gonna go crazy. That nigga go go nuts, That's a feature bro. I'll definitely. He's gonna be worshiping he Satan on that shit. You gotta get that nigga on the W and remix. He's gonna be worshiping Satan on that song, man. Your beats will be perfect for that. I mean, that's what he's into, right? You gotta chill. We don't need the demon shit on the song. Look, you got to get that nigga on the <laughs> WNA remix and put all y'all niggas on it and go viral. Yeah, I ain't going to lie. Lil Uzi? He talking, yeah. Hell yeah. Gotta be fine. Future be talking too. Who talking? Future be going crazy, bro. Mm. Niggas don't know. I ain't going to lie. Like, and he, I ain't going to eat mainstream too. I ain't going to lie. Uh, I, need fucking a, with? I need a feature from Dirk. I don't listen to his new shit, but I, I know he nice. Like, I won't say Future whack. <laughs> like, he not whack. Mm. You think rappers like Uzi are like, Kind of not trying to fuck with drill rappers because they don't want to get wrapped up in some shit that don't got nothing to do with them. Nah. I don't, I don't know. That. I wonder I like how I much they think to about be honest, that. I feel like he don't care. I feel like he just gonna do whatever. He feel fire. Sometimes probably, when you so famous, yeah. it don't matter. Yeah, yeah. he probably just ain't too reach rich. Out to none yet. 
Nobody's going to think of it like that. Yeah. Like, and he going to come up there doing the little hip shit, bro. He good. <laughs> yeah. Nah. Like, no, he going to be in the video doing the hip shit. He's got gonna an make assistant that's going to be like, listen, you don't want to do that dance. He not going to be in there gang banging with him. He going to be doing all of this, nigga. Bro, if Uzi did that dance, you would not hear the end of it. They're going to be talking about that on Academics and World Star and Vlad and here every fucking day. Not this one. No, I said this one. You lying to him, but not this one. What? Whoa, yeah, that would Blur that good. shit out. Not the other Blur me one. doing it out. I'm not trying to be involved in this. Hey, man. you just lost your mind up here, bro. You got to chill, I didn't. Dude. I thought you were talking about a different hip nah, thing. Nah, not yeah, that yeah. one. Yeah. Nah, this, yeah. hey, this nigga right here, you trying to get me in some shit, bro. Well, I've seen cops doing it, teachers doing it in the shit. Yo, bro. I can't do it. I'm, I'm not doing it. I'm just doing that an that example. Yeah, we. you good. Damn. Yo, so so what is life like? Being y'all at this point, being that like you've, you've blown up, you're getting all these views and shit, but still, you know, you got to move around Manhattan and shit. What's life like? I shit mean, fun. we're in California, right? Right now, yeah. yeah. Life is this good. This shit calm right now, I'm not going to lie. I don't let this shit fool you. I'm How old are y'all? I'm 19. 19? How old are you, five? I'm 18. Yeah, I'm 18. 20. Uh, it's you the oldest one. Yeah, you feel yeah. like you big bro? Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> don't let that don't let that shit fool you. Not at all. I'm not even gonna say nothing. Don't. Said, nah. don't, let that, don't let that age shit fool you. <laughs> the kid. I'm not gonna do it. How it feel being so young and lit? You feel me? I know that gotta be fire. Young yeah, niggas going. It's mad. I'm winning win them for the money, to be honest. So <laughs> that that's gonna change shit for real. Yeah. But independent nigga, that might be the route. Y'all could definitely yeah, keep fact. going crazy with the independent, bro. But y'all each doing fire numbers individually. How that feel too? Like you feel me dropping individually, all doing y'all shit. That's a fact. I ain't gonna that lie. Shit crazy, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. You got a lie. Jay Hound came out of nowhere piece. with the Nikki. Yeah. Nigga, you went, I wasn't Damn. expecting the Nikki, bro. The nigga went crazy. Y'all, y'all heard Nikki part two yet? Yeah, yeah, both yeah. parts. Nigga, you went crazy. Yeah, no yeah. cap. You yeah, too, nigga, with the uh, live performance freestyle. All y'all, yeah. bro. Niggas individually going crazy and collectively. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. My son KJ. Mm-hmm. So yeah, it's more KJ y'all. Shot it, it's, it. it's more niggas who, who go viral too around y'all too. Like it's more niggas that's gonna pop up. Yeah. Mm. My son yeah, has KJ. I got a song with, with, with that's somebody from my block. Like, 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 for me, SK, Rally Guns. I mean, we got songs and Penny shit Capone. that be going viral on TikTok and shit. I seen but y'all did some shit with uh, Kenzo. How that, how that happened? The uh, Kenzo it? B feature. I recorded a video. I was like, "Yo, for me, hop on the feature. Whoever want to get on this, send me. A, oh, I'm gonna send y'all the over. And whoever go crazy for me, we shoot a vid. For me, she went crazy and we shot a video. Nah, yeah. Do you guys respect the YouTubers who make videos about your lives, particularly my man Swayze? You said about what? I about mean, Gotham lives. City in the Batmobile. Do we respect YouTubers that make videos about our lives? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, Damn, none of them should be accurate. I, I feel like that'd be some cop shit. Yeah, it'd police, be some cop shit. Police activity. Man, it don't be accurate all the time. Accurate. Yeah, it don't it be just accurate. Be accurate. Like, you got to get the right type of shit for me. So you wouldn't trip if it was facts, but because niggas be capping, you not feeling it. Shit, I'm not going to lie, though. Yeah. I fuck with Swayze for Swayze be showing love some songs for me. I should still put a bad image on you, though, if he talk about bad shit. So you feel like the YouTubers got a big influence of like putting bad shit on niggas' names? Certain YouTubers. Yeah, yeah certain know. people, yeah. I've seen a BMG Everclass with a crazy ass thumbnail reacting to the this song, the Swept Up or whatever the fuck that other song was about. <laughs> he's just, I look like a gamer thumbnail. I was like, damn, <laughs> he's all the way in the YouTuber game now. Uh, I ain't seen that shit. Nah, it was, it's, it's yeah, a lot. I ain't gonna lie. I mean, I, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, BMG <laughs> calm take. for me. I'm hot. Calm. You said what? Calm. Does everybody say that where you're from, or you just got like a unique swag? Because that's a UK thing, right? What? Calm. 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 Just describing right everything right as calm. Lingo. Not right niggas. Right. Lingo is crazy. I, I, what? I got some questions, nigga. What is Nikki and what is Grinching? Mm. Grinching? Yeah. What's Grinching? Grinching is like Grinching like trapping, you getting nothing, money, like, like hustling. Yeah. Grinching is working. Because Shawnee says that all the time, too, right? He got Grinch gang and all that. And niggas. Nikki? I didn't know what none of it mean. You yeah. feel me? It just yeah, what Nikki mean? Like, Nikki just like, one. that's what the females want to do with us type shit. They want to get Nikki? They want to get Nikki. So basically, yeah, she get freaky, they move. but you but feel me? They want to flip that. They want to hit that hip shit type shit when they around us type shit. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. That's right. So y'all came up with that or that's just some shit that was already around and you came up with that? It been around, but my son J had made it 
a thing. A rap. That's huh. yeah. My son Jay Stamp. That's a fact. They've been nigga. around though, but my son Jay Stamp that. Mm. Jay, it, Jay made it viral. Is it crazy seeing girls treat y'all totally different all of a sudden? Is that is that happening? What you mean? It's just funny, but it's cool though. You didn't smash any garbs that was dissing you back in the day? Nah, I'm not. I don't, talk about oh, that. oh, you dubbing them? They all got girls. Y'all dubbing them? Talk about it. Uh, <laughs> I'll be dubbing a lot of bitches. I don't even get That's that. right. You said we dubbing them, not talking about it. So if if you fuck a girl, you just you act like it never happened. You nah, never you talk, talk about, about it. the bitches that was dissing them. Yeah, yeah. Back yeah. in the day, he said, "Nah, it's out." This is shaving. <laughs> Gillette, Gillette. <laughs> but that yeah. is pretty good advice. Can't don't talk me. about either kind of body. Yes. You know. It'll serve you well in life. Oh, yes. Keep a hush. Yeah, because yes, you can fuck way sh- more girls if they don't know that you fucked all their friends, right? I don't even know. Some bitches what like the that fuck shit. Is going on? I mean, they <laughs> probably still gonna figure it out, <laughs> <Yo>. right? But <laughs> <laughs> he's one of them. I forgot. <laughs> now your next topic, though. Yeah, that's the whole topic. <laughs> yeah. That's right. All right. So what what y'all got coming out? Anything new that we should be looking out for? Naughty Dottie just dropped. Yeah, Naughty Dottie just Naughty dropped. Naughty mm-hmm. And I'm dropping the Dolly. Nicki Paul Two just dropped. I got a solo coming out. Yeah. The I mean, tape drop already? No. Nah. Nah. Nah, What's going on with the tape? What Ask it? Nas. <laughs> What's Ask niggas Nas. holding the tape. I've been seeing niggas talking about the tape for like two months. What's going <laughs> on? Nas. Chill, chill. That shit, on hold. that shit on pause. That shit on pause. <laughs> to be continued. Yeah. You going to leave it at that. Dot, dot, dot. going to drop, bro. Dot, dot, dot. Yeah, I just don't know. It's crazy. They holding the tape now. Dot, dot, dot. Mm. It's coming soon. Tape dropping soon. Shit dropping in January. Dot, dot, dot. What, what's the problem? Don't you got mad music or, <laughs> or are you just waiting on certain shit business wise? It's, it's just on hold. Like, it's, yeah. it's gonna dot, drop. Dot, dot, we dot. just not. Y'all gonna get it. Putting it it's out. Like, it's not like y'all not gonna get it. Y'all gonna get it. But yeah. dot, dot, dot. Though. It's not coming. <laughs> dot, 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 dot. Dot, dot, it's not dot. coming like on some this week shit. Or... It ain't coming soon. Next nah, topic. nah. It is coming soon, but not on some this week shit. Next topic. Next week. Yeah. Next topic. Yo. Dot, dot, Next topic. Dot. The project is. I don't know why the project <laughs> is controversial. So niggas gonna keep dropping singles and and together and shit. Yeah, we huh? got Mad Alpha shit. Who's that guy? Mad Alpha Fire. Mm. All right, anybody you guys wanna shout out? Anything we need to know before we wrap this up? What you mean? Sweepers E N T yeah. YouTube mm-hmm. J Harrow S dot Go now it's G P G J J Five E M S. Yo underscore S dot Go my I G mm-hmm. ain't gonna lie at me. G P G J J underscore. My shit so underscore. Nazi I love sweet. you five. Two underscores. Yo, yeah, YouTube, S.Go, you already know. I have my TikTok, S.Go64, man. And get in tune with Produced by Double M. Yeah, yeah for a fact. Right. Produced by Double M. Engineered by Kali Park. Engineered by Park. Shout out Sean. Shout out my too, manager. Man. King Go tune in to my son, SK. Rally Guns, all of them. Shout out all my guys, you heard few of my pros. A whole lot of shout outs, nigga. When whole you guys lot post of them. group photos, do you tag everybody? Or am I just, I'm going to have to be on your Instagrams for like two days figuring out everybody's different ads? All right. Sometimes. Nah, we be tagging <laughs> I everybody. I send niggas' Instagrams on. to Mikey. Oh, okay. It's good. Oh, he got it. You know, I'm handling shit up here, my boy. Felt right. you, my boy. Damn, and yeah. What, <laughs> oh, so these are these French fries you were bitching about? What? Where, what is this spot? <laughs> this nigga went right to the grill. <laughs> nah, because they was talking about Easter Greek fries, French fries. About. Yeah, it was Greek French fries. <laughs> they were crazy. Niggas said these French fries. You was, French fries. was French bitching about. It tastes <laughs> like garlic bread. It like, was just know? a little too much. Too much shit on it. It just tastes like toast. I would never eat it. It would say pain. It tastes like garlic bread. Like like this the the garlic bread from the grocery store. I like them. You was fucking with it. Me and Five cleaned our plates. You a long way from the I'm not bodega, that burger was fire for me. <laughs> he said the fries was dirt, and my he cleaned, plate was full he, of French fries. Like I he cleaned, cleaned his plate. Wait, five said the fries was dirt. He cleaned his he plate. He cleaned his plate. Okay, what that means? How they was nasty, he, gang? Was you hungry. murdered him. It wasn't was a French hungry. fry on his plate. I don't know. Like, I was hungry. Yeah. He was just hungry. There's no way it was dirt. And he ate the other order of fries. He hey, he did press that it was dirt. Like yo, he protesting that that shit dirt. We three hours behind. That shit tastes like garlic toast, bro. That's it. I thought it was like four or five o'clock gangster. Nah. What time is it in New York right now? It's, it's like four, four o'clock seven. in New York. Niggas got layover still. Y'all need to go to Porto's. Yo, I just looked at my phone and it was one o'clock. Yo, yo, where the club? Porto's? 
Portos. Oh, pornos? Not pornos. Cool. Pornos? No, <laughs> Portos. It's like a restaurant. We're going to send you that. You got to get me in the fucking industry. You got to get me in the industry. You want to do porn? I want to get in the fucking porn industry. 18. I got to wait a few years, bro. You got to fucking get me in there. Bro. Yeah, but he, he needs a grace period. I'm not getting him in the game <laughs> no, 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 as soon as he turns 18. I was waiting to fucking tell you this. You have to fucking get me on porn. He said you got to get me on porn. You have to get me on fucking porn. He probably lying about his age. He said, nah, I had to tell you before we leave. I had to tell you. I was going to wait before the interview, but you know what? Oh, my God. Listen, Wait, this you're that guy, pal. Yeah. All oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you guys are going to go far. There's big things coming, for sure. Shout out to the like sweepers. Porn. Go check them out. Yeah, like porn. <laughs> check them out on uh, YouTube nah, and all that shit. Uh, no Jumper, coolest podcast of the world. Shout out to my boy, Sus. We out. We out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was hard. Hell yeah. yeah that was good. Yeah. That was funny as fuck. That's our best interview. I watched one of you guys go. <laughs> yeah, that shit was so